we take a group of monkeys, a ladder, a bunch of bananas and a garden hose. What we end up with is a pretty astounding display of social behavior. All of this is further described in the five monkeys experiment. Curious to find out what this is all about? Then make sure you stick around. In the first phase of this hypothetical experiment, five monkeys are placed in a cage with a ladder leading to a bunch of bananas hanging from the ceiling. Now, monkeys being monkeys, it's only a matter of time before one of them tries to climb up the ladder to snatch a banana. However, every time a monkey tries to do so, the researcher sprays all of the monkeys with cold water. Now, I don't know about you, but that sounds pretty damn horrible to me. And the soaking wet monkeys seem to agree with this. After a few repetitions, the monkeys learn that climbing the ladder leads to being sprayed with cold water, so they stop chasing after the bananas. Now we enter the second phase of the experiment. The researcher replaces one of the monkeys with a new monkey who has never been sprayed with cold water. So now we have four original monkeys and one newcomer. Being the curious primate that he is, the latest addition to the group immediately tries to climb the ladder. However, the other monkeys are not having this. After all, they prefer to stay nice and dry. Now even though there's no sign of water being sprayed, they attack the new monkey in order to prevent him from going up. The confused new monkey quickly learns that climbing the ladder is not allowed, even though he's not sure why, since he has never been sprayed with cold water himself. Now we enter the third phase of this experiment. This is where things get really interesting. Once again, the researcher replaces one of the original monkeys. We now have three original monkeys and two newcomers. And once more, it won't take long before it sees the bananas and decides to go for it. As you might expect, the remaining original monkeys still live with the vivid memory of getting sprayed with cold water and attack the monkey that climbs up the ladder. Interestingly, the monkey that was added right before this, even though it was never sprayed with water, joins in on the action. He doesn't know why. All he knows is that the perpetrator has to be stopped. The experiment is then repeated with the remaining monkeys. One by one, an original monkey is removed and a new monkey comes in. Eventually, all of the original monkeys are replaced with new monkeys who have never been sprayed with cold water. But what do you think happens when a new monkey tries to climb up the ladder to take a banana? As you might have guessed by now, the whole group still attacks him, even though none of them have ever seen the garden hose inside of their cage. But why? What causes this behavior? What would any of the new monkeys say if you could ask them why they would attack anyone who goes for the banana? Many people have philosophized about this, and most of them have come to the same conclusion. You'll probably hear them say, because that's just the way it is.